Sports and Youth Affairs Minister Shaklyar Warjri on Tuesday informed of the launch of the Super Elite Program of the Department for Athlete Development. Under the program, 12 athletes with high potential will be trained by international coaches and a dedicated development program with the aim of competing at national and international levels. The project, under the STAR program notified by the government of Meghalaya, is a part of Chief Minister Konrad Sangma's vision to develop Olympic athletes by 2032. The athletes were selected through a year-long process by the Meghalaya State Olympic Association under the supervision of H10, an Australian company led by Mr. Ian Campbell, a reputed Olympian. Uh, there is one program from the department which we call the Elite Program, where uh, with the MS, along with the MSOA, so it's across all uh, the districts from our state, so we've had about 14,500 athletes. So this program was to test all these athletes and to further send them for better uh, 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 training, I can say. So from these 14,500, we've selected 200, out of which some of them have dropped out, out of which 172 were selected. And after further training and further this. So we have selected nine, nine athletes. So these nine athletes will now be trained for a period of three years. Where from the government side, in terms of everything we will look after, uh, we will pay for the tuition, for the training. And we have uh, Mr. Jan Campbell, who is an Olympian from Australia, we have gone along with his team. So we will be the one, we will be the ones, we uh, will be the ones, training these nine athletes. So in the course of three years, we are hoping that these nine athletes after this training can represent our state on an international level as well and even Olympics. Where will the training be? Uh, we'll be in Shillong and the in the course of three years, we'll be some in Shillong and then we'll be sending them you know, national levels and even international levels. How much will you will the government be spending on that? Uh, that uh, as of now, like I said, we just decided yesterday, so we don't have the numbers as of now. We'll have to work on it.